After battling all season for a playoff spot, the Victoria Royals found out just how hard the postseason can be on Friday night as they fell to Kamloops by a 4-1 final. Last night, the two teams were right back at it for game number two, where the Royals were looking to steal home ice advantage. Royals didn't play bad in game one, but needed some finish and need to solve Blazers goalie Cole Sheveldave. It was a tight first period, but late in the frame, Ben Walker will hook Jordan DePat on a breakaway. That's a no-no. DePat will get the penalty shot, and he's going to rip it past Keith Hamilton. Just like that, it's one zip for the Blazers after one. Home side keeps coming to start the second. Tim Bozon driving hard to the net. First shot stop, but gets his own rebound for his third of the postseason. And look out as Kamloops have a 2-0 lead. But the Royals will get that one back a few minutes later. Jamie Crook sent in alone. He's going to tally his first of the playoffs. Got ourselves a hockey game. It's 2-1. But just like in game one, the Blazers start rocking in the middle frame on the power play when Brady Gauday gets left alone at the back door. He taps it in for the easy tally. That gives Kamloops a 3-1 advantage. Good crowd at the uh, Interior Saving Center last night. A few minutes after that, Blazers will get another pass to Hamilton. This time Chase Schaber gets it to go from tight. Kamloops led this game 6-1 after the second, pretty much over. But to the Royals' credit, they had a pretty good third. Robin Sudek scores his second of the postseason here. The Royals outscored the Blazers 3-1 in the third, but too little too late. Blazers take it 7-4 the final. Take a 2-0 series lead. Series shifts to Victoria for Game 3 on Tuesday night. Yeah, they're uh, they're a type of team that can score on the drop of a hat. They they got lots of skill up front and lots of firepower. So we uh, we just got to stick to the system and stay structured throughout the full 60 minutes of play, and uh, it'll work for us for sure. You know, you can never get down. I mean, we got to push back, especially when they score one or two in a row. Um, we can't sag on the bench, and that's an important thing we got to learn, especially for the young guys. Is in playoffs when you score a goal or whatever happens, you got to push back. And you know, it's a seven-game series, uh, and you know, and we have two games at home here where we have a big crowd in front of us and. Uh, hopefully get some momentum and, and be in the next game here. We're not going away. You know, we got some guys that have more. You know, our top six has to be better. And a couple of our older D have got to be better as well. So we know there's more there. So, uh, we've, you know, we're not done yet.